Hello, welcome to Successful Trading. I have been using E-Trade for option trading for over seven years. I have recently have been using testing Webu for the same purpose, which begs the question, is Webu or E-Trade best for option trading beginners? I almost, almost gave the edge to the much hard newcomer Webu, but there is this one thing just one thing that precluded me from leaning toward Webull in this Webull versus E-Trade uh, to find out the best option trading platform for uh, beginners. Without any further ado, let me go and unveil the reason, the one reason that prevented me from picking Webull in this comparison. All right, folks. All right. Uh, welcome to the show. It's a little bit chilly on here, so maybe allow me to be a little bit more comfortable in this recording. Sorry, I didn't want to start like like, like that. Okay, <laughs> it's it's yeah Saturday morning in December, even in California. Webull versus E-Trade. Okay, which one is best uh, for an option trading beginner? Yeah, if you find yourself in, in, in this scenario. So we are going to take a look at very quick features on here one by one and break it down for you. I just recently installed my uh, Weibo uh, desktop app and everything else. So I've been bringing you reviews for that. So here's Weibo. The first thing that's for us, we give the edge for to 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 Weibo. Oh, before before I forget, the free shares. Yeah, Weibo give free shares. E Trade doesn't give free shares. So maybe I should have put that on there. So and I'm going to put a link on the description for you to get your free shares. It's it's legit. Ah, uh, I, I got my free shares. Uh, can I show my free shares? We have shown my free shares here before, but let me show you actually uh, option expiration notice. That's not really what we are looking for. Uh, where, where was my, my free shares uh, claim? So yeah, these are my free shares, folks. Yeah. So these two, SWN already got them. So these in transit, December 4th. Is that what they're saying? December 4th? That they're in transit. Okay, so we should be getting them on the 24th. Okay, sorry for, for about that. So, uh, looking, 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 looking forward to, 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 to that here. Okay, so you can claim your free shares by just signing up for an account. Aside from that, apart from that, uh, <laughs> let us take a look here. What's, what's make, uh, Weibo, uh, better, uh, at least when it comes to, 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 to trading as a, an option trading beginner when we say option trading beginner you could be trading stock you could be trading options obviously that's just a shortcut that we're using so webull allows you to buy fractional shares we have shared that in a video that we are going to put in here again in the description currently our friend at some um, uh power e-trade do not or e-trade in general do not have that feature yet maybe something that's going to be coming so for that we give the edge as far as our fractional shares trading to Weibo. The second next thing that we are looking at, item that we are going to be looking up in this comparison of Weibo or E-Trade, uh, which one is better for option trading beginners, is the ability to chart your option. We have talked about this for us on here. This is a game changer, yeah? Because we trade the option and instead of spending the time watching how the stock price is moving, there are other factors that determine the strike of um, the, the the value of an option that you are trading. Many, many times I had some, we were discussing late yesterday with Mr. Matt from New York, who he was telling me is he had a put and a call on Tesla. Yeah. And I don't know which direction Tesla was going, but both were appreciating at the same time. Crazy stuff. Yes. So hence for us, we like to spend the time on here to educate you on the, the ability to, tr uh, to track your position rather using, um, using the, the option chart rather than uh, the, the, the the stock chart when the position is open here's how you do that on here for instance it's just a simple click yeah i will come here and i don't know whatever option let's say the 370 puts on here and i just click on that one and oh it's, all, it's almost spawned me you know i was almost denied i was like, not available oh lord this is it here this is the option chart for uh january 15 uh 2021 370 puts it's quite expensive 600 
yeah, six hundred seventy dollars or six hundred six dollars seventy cents uh, in um, in the price of the option. Uh, why am I on in January? I don't even know. I could be misleading people. You know, we don't buy such expensive options on here. So December twenty first is Monday. Yeah, that's the one I was looking for, and it didn't dawn on me. Why are they so expensive? Six dollars and something. So let's do that again. <laughs> I am sti I still have January. Oh my goodness, what the silly me! Now I have February. What's going on here? <laughs> this is the one I want. Okay, <laughs> so December twenty first, and they are going for a dollar thirty two. Are you okay? So the the close in the mornings. But I mean, any which one that you want, I just click on here and I click on charts. Zoom. So by tracking this, and notice that on here, what do we have on this chart? We have the same. Technical indicators, upper Bollinger, lower Bollinger. I have my VWAP on here and my moving averages as well. My VWAP here is actually in white, the white line. And then the relative strength index. You know, most traders, you really like that. The option chart has that as well. The MACD, the option chart. Oh man, the MACD. Don't let me, I need to be making a video on how to use the MACD because in terms of providing you a direction, especially early when you get into the trade, because always on the side, it's right like the first 30 minutes, but that back day usually tells the story on spot. I need to make a video on that. So this gives the edge to eBay. So Power E Trade enables you to chart option charts uh, that you are trading. So Webull, to my knowledge, doesn't have that as of now. The next uh, thing that we are going to compare on here it's option trading simulator. As a, an option trading beginner, you will want to be able to simulate what your trade is going to be look like. The best one that I've seen right now, there are others out there, but uh, the Trade Lab, we have featured that in the previous video. I'm going to put the link in the description. So you can come on here and say, hey, I want to buy, I don't know how many December 370 calls or puts, whatever. And actually, let me make it a little bit more realistic to what things that we buy here. You know, our three point rule on SPY. Oh, I need to put another link in the description. So let's say I got this ad and then uh, what do I want to add? If I'm carrying the position overnight, you know what I'm adding, right? I'm adding in an edge. Yes, this, this is how I, a hedge, rather. An edge. <laughs> yeah, that's my edge. Oh, by, by adding a hedge to my position, I'm getting an edge. The kangaroo market <laughs> will not get me, no matter what happened the next day. So here, let, let's actually simulate this properly because this is a question that I get all the time. Hey, Telex, how much hedge should I be using? So here, if let's say my thesis is bullish based on my technical analysis, so here I'm buying calls for 10 calls for let's say 430, right? So I will always sell traders. They are not the same price. The cooler and the puts are actually, let me pick a, the decent, the, the right one here. So the puts, and let's say I want them at three, uh, three points again, 366, they're about. The, so here they are equivalent. So typically, but obviously they should be because I'm taking three dollars away apart from each other. But we showed you Friday in the pre-market analysis. We showed you how puts were way more expensive at the beginning, and turns out the market went down first uh, on on uh, uh, um, quadruple reaching day, <laughs> which was yesterday Friday. So in this case on here, uh, I, it just there's no need for math or anything because the price are the same. So meaning, I, if I'm saying that I want to hedge thirty percent, I take three contract. If I want to hedge forty percent. I take four contract. If I want to hedge 50%, I take five contract. That's typically the range that I hedge my position in. So in option trading simulator, we save this strategy on here. Fantastic. And then we go to the trading lab to look at it. How by varying the price of the underlying. Yeah, that's meaning the price of SPY in this case. That's our underlying. underlying you see how much your profit go, go, go uh, evolve or so meaning the red area here is your losing area yes that, that's what it means you i'm going to show it better actually so meaning if let's say the puts the price really start going down you will make money if the stock goes to 355 362 you're making money you so you start making money on here uh, for you let's say for the call side if you are above uh let's say 371.61 and as the call win you win you win more or obviously because you have more calls than puts uh, and everything but this is this is the best here the spectral density folks yeah it's even better in, in the spectral density so what is this thing on here the timeline is in here and the price is here and you can just vary it from day to day 
to say, okay, if the price does something, so the price of the underlying here is on the vertical axis, what's your profit will be in percentage and in terms of uh, uh, dollar amount, obviously. It's, yeah, you have 10 calls of, of, of SPY and it goes to 380. Then bagger. <laughs> but similarly, because you're hedge, folks, if let's say this, this is the spy start going down, down now and uh, you took the 366 uh, puts five of them you are making money the, the losing area is this one on here price getting stuck between i can me simulate that here between 364 93 but even then you, you're gaining here a little bit here you are gaining a so in the loser you are losing 68 percent of your position if the stock is relatively flat on here in, in in that zone and then they give you probability here for people nerd like me we we can just play with this window to see okay actually let's look at this this window here so the, what's the probability of losing here that's the red the red area right so they are telling us that a strategy like this one the probability that the stock uh it's in what range 365 92 to 372 well, though, yeah, this is the winning probability, meaning, yeah, or, 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 or that's if, if it, it, it does this. So 97% or something. I mean, it, it, it gives you a, an idea on that. If the price gets stuck where we are right now, we are losing 70% of the position. But so this is a quick view of the trade lab. Um, it's so meaning trade lab or it's, they call the, the name of the feature is called trade lab. But instead of me describing the future to you, I rather bring you the benefit. The benefit is the ability for you to predict where your position is going to go. And I kid you not, if you have never done hedging before, this tool enables you to do that a great deal. Same similarly, there is another version of that word, but I use that less often where you have all your position and then you say the whole market goes down by 1% or so. But here individually per position, before you take the position, you can simulate your option. This is the one of the best option trading simulator. And for that, we give the edge to power e trade. Next item on the line is level two. Level two is none other than to see the depth when you're trading, right? As, as a trader, you want to see the depth of the order book so this is what some uh what it looks like inside of each trade so well, they, they, they they give you this is nice i mean you you can look at it here but folks they recently i stumbled onto this thing on here uh if you want to look at your your your, your level two on uh, on weibo yeah so here for me actually i'm going to be doing this on this one on here so this is level one tick by tick ordering uh, that, that that's that time of sales that come in but this is the one that I want to, to bring you. So they take all of the, the, the values and then they provide this volume analysis. I have been experimenting with it. As of now, I have seen some consistency, but I'm waiting to gather more data to definitely give you an indication on here. So for instance, here you will say it will tell you red, for instance, will mean that at that level, how many shares were actually traded at that and what was the dominating side, the bearish or the bullish side. I saw it work marvelously a couple of weeks ago and I was like, aha, I got something. And then I applied it on a couple of stocks. I think it was uh, one of those uh, crazy stocks. One of them was, was, was which was from Roku and uh, maybe Nvidia. It didn't quite go. Yeah, I mean, my, yeah, my paper account, I've been making money. I'm green on my paper account. So I've been experimenting a lot of things with this. But level two uh, and the order book. I give the edge definitely to Weibo because they provide you more in depth as we saw on here in terms of uh, that, 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 that level too. But then they, they couple that with uh, the, what they call volume analysis to give you pretty much, especially in the early going, right? The first 10, 15 minutes, by looking at that, you can say that, hey, there was a huge sell volume at the beginning. If let's say the stock is going the opposite direction, you can definitely say, hey, let me short the stock because that volume there at some point it will come back. It did that beautiful the other day. Or let me buy put in in uh, for for that on the line. All right, now folks, last but not least, the reason, the reason, the reason why I could not pick Webull as the best <laughs> platform for option trading for beginners is. The paper trading account ladies and gentlemen yes we will give you one million dollars to trade on your paper trading accounts fantastic i've been enjoying it because it allows me to do save so many things how much does um uh each trade gives you a hundred thousand 
like both of them you can reset them obviously at will but my friend the one thing that is missing in Weibo paper trading is the ability to trade option no option trading in this paper account that is no bueno so for that i am sorry i'm sorry Weibo as of now i cannot recommend you as the flat out <laughs> best choice for option trading beginners to go because we want we want we want um uh, option trading beginners to get their hands on paper trading of option because there are so many nuances so that they are comfortable before they go live with their money so i hope that you enjoyed this video so for the time being hopefully in the near future Weibull is adding a lot of features that we will continue to bring you as benefits to you as an option trading beginner here at successful trading have a great day have a great afternoon have a great evening wherever you're watching from bye bye